And good Monday morning. It is time for the Word on Wall Street. Top investors watching your money. Joining me right now is Michael Lee, strategy founder, Michael Lee, and Bolte Capital Chief Market Strategist, Catherine Rooney-Vera. Great to see you guys this morning. Happy Monday. Catherine, kicking things off with you with a quiet market. But is it the quiet ahead of the storm with Jay Powell on the Hill this week? He's got his two-day testimony before Congress tomorrow and Wednesday. We're going to see if he's going to double down on we're not done yet. We got more rate hikes to come. We're going to go big or we'll go home. It's been almost a year since the Fed started raising rates. March 17th was the first 25 basis point hike. Markets now are fully pricing in another 25 basis point hike at the March meeting, Catherine. But look at this market rallying at the any any you know comment of it's going to be 25 basis. We're close to the end. But inflation is still elevated. How do you see things? The Fed really wants the markets to believe, Maria, that it's serious this time. It's going to get inflation down when really it was one of the, the culprits of why we're here in the first place. That combined, of course, with massive fiscal deficits and a government that's really gone haywire with regard to deficit spending. Um, so I fear that uh, the market doesn't believe the Fed, and I think with good reason. Um, the Fed has got us to this point and has not been able to get inflation back to the 2% par target. In fact, when in the last meeting, when I believe Maria should have hiked 50 basis points, I was hoping the Fed would hike 50 basis points. It decreased the pace of the, the hikes to 25. So the market really believes that the Fed has more than a dual mandate. The dual mandate, of course, being uh, price stability, um, targeting 2% on average, and full employment. The market seems to think the Fed and believe the Fed when it has a, a more broadened mandate, which incorporates financial conditions and extension of the economic cycle, which of course it is not mandated to do. Uh, but over mm -hmm. the past 10, 15 years, we have all, we being market participants, anyone alive, breathing in this market and working in these, time, in these times, has been conditioned, conditioned to believe that the Fed is here to back us up and that the Fed is not going to allow what previously was discounted, which is a recession and a natural yeah. phenomenon moving from one phase of the economic cycle to the other. So I think I think noise is coming. I think that we're in for a rocky road. I think that yeah. uh, that inflation has to get to the 2% target. It is an arbitrary number. We can argue about why it's 2%, but the Fed is not going to change the target when the reality is three times the target. So that's not going yeah. to happen. The market shouldn't expect it. So, Catherine, what are you doing then in terms of investing right now? Are you raising cash if you say it's going to be rocky road this year? Yes, I actually do like cash. I like cash and cash equivalents. You can get commercial paper, three-month, six-month, 12-month uh, T-bills for 5%. So when you compare that, Maria, with um, the, the equity risk premium, which is around 2.2%, it looks remarkably attractive. So yes, I prefer risk-free assets, uh, which around about 5%, of course, that's an annualized number, but it's a very attractive number uh, when we're looking at uh, a recession, which has not been fully discounted, and a Fed that really and truly this time has to get to the 2% target, which in my view, and this is debatable, my view is that to get there, we need to get unemployment up to about 5%. We need an economic contraction. And I think we need to be in cash. I think we need to be in defensives. And I think we need to be in, in short-term uh, fixed income risk-free assets. Yeah, I mean, look, I, I don't disagree on this economy slowing. I, I do expect some kind of a recession as well, Catherine. I think you're right on. All right, we'll leave it there. Great run on Wall Street, guys. Thank you. Catherine uh, Rooney, Vera, Michael Lee, we will see you soon. Quick